M0FXP, welcome to my channel, Uniden SDS200E scanner. And the nice thing about this scanner is that it has a Wi-Fi or a Ethernet connection at the front, which means we can control it completely wirelessly with our laptop, but we do need to configure it. So the first thing we do is connect the Ethernet cable to the front of the device and plug the other end of that cable into our broadband router. Then we will go into the menu settings like so, push the menu and we'll scroll down to settings. Then push the silver button, scroll down again until we get to LAN settings. Like so, now mine's already flashing. I didn't have to turn it on. If you have to turn yours on, just enable it. But otherwise we can go down and go show IP. And there's all the numbers we need. Now, we only really need the top one, which is 192.168.0.114. Yours may be different. So we can back out. We know it's connecting. The lights are flashing. Now, it might ask you to reboot, but that's fine. If it asks you to reboot, just do it. And then everything will start flashing away. Next thing, you know, next thing is, instead of using a COM port like you would normally do, where you'd have a micro USB into your computer, you will select COM port here just here like so and you would drop down the menu here and you will select URL and then select URL setup and this little window comes up and with a bit of luck you can just go auto detect and it's going to find here the correct IP address and the model of your scanner which is SDS 200 in this case and then just click select available okay and that's it straight away we're already controlling our radio and I'll just show you that if we just close these windows we can do the volume let's click the volume here I'm not sure if you can hear it but we can do the volume we can select department system you can see it changing working great channels we can scroll through as you can see there now the next thing we need is the audio coming from our PC. So to do that, we have more tabs here. Look, if you look here underneath the, the big screen, and one of them is called audio control. And all you do is drop down here where it says input sound device, drop it down. And just instead of connecting your, you know, normally you'd have your PC or your microphone or something, connect URL then select url setup and this window appears click auto detect again we've got the auto detect that's fine select available and you're all connected and hopefully you're going to get some audio coming out of your pc let's close this and so now you can walk around your house and when there's audio turn up the pc volume and you'll be able to listen to your scanner anywhere you like and if you had an ip address of your house an external ip address because at the moment we're using local ip address which is basically all the ethernet cables in this house and the wireless connectivity that you get from your broadband router if we get the house ip address and we will say i'm in the uk and we were in say australia and we had the ip address and this was all turned on we could now turn on completely control we've got our antenna connected here which is in the loft can control this whole device from outside the house as well as inside the house so it's very handy so that's it thanks for watching my channel please hit the like button and subscribe if you find this helpful and we are using the pro scan software i will put a link in the description there is a 30-day free trial to do this thanks for watching my channel and 73 catch you on air all the best